was in the backyard barking. I mean, barking up a storm. And I stay in the white neighborhood. So that's some peace disturbance. You can't just have your dog out there barking all day. So I went out the, out the backyard and trying to see what he was barking. And boy, what is wrong with you? Why are you doing all that barking? So he was pointed toward the bushes. His attention was directed toward them big bushes back there. So I go, I hear there's something. I can't, there's something in them bushes. So I unleashed King. You go get him. You know, King ran in the house. So I'm like, what is he? What is he scared of? So my nose is out. That's my yard. I ain't had that blinky on me, though. So I walk over to the bushes. Y'all know there's a big wolf in them bushes? Oh, man, I took off. He come after me. So I see he was after me. So I did this. You know, when a black person do this, we get that second speed. I mean, I left him. Took off. Went in the house, closed the door. He ran into the door. Blah, 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 blah. So I'm heated, man. I'm steamed. I go looking for King. Y'all know that dog was under the bed. So I'm like, all right, all right, you left me out there. You gonna do this? How you gonna do me? You left me out there. When you come from under that bed, you fire. He say, when you got me from the pound, you said my only job was to let you know when danger was around. I did my job. So I went and looked at the contract. Y'all know that boy, that dog was right. I couldn't find him. Oh, boy.